We're in the middle of a training contest called the Sprint LA 2024. We're not in, the, in a good position, we're eighth. The first thing is tourists. Yeah, I'm gonna submit it. Uh, oh, you're recording, sorry, sorry. Yeah, yeah, I'm recording. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Boy, I have two eyes. Piling. Oh, it's going. Nice. Except. Nice. Yeah. Cool. Let's see what is our rank. Yeah. We are fifth again. Wait a minute? Yeah. Oh, you wanna watch? Yeah. Okay. I wanna record. Go ahead. <laughs> okay. All right. You good? Yeah. Okay. Alright. Here we go. Submitting L because why not? Um I hope it works, I guess. We shall see. Ah. Okay. Still there. <laughs>
three, two, five. Oh, the logos of the universities are added. You know, there's a logo of, uh, nice. the uni and we are the first one who has a logo. Nice. So between the universities and tourists solved all the problems. <laughs> yeah. Do you think every team in NACF participated? If they were, it was so good. Yeah. For sure, MIT had not participated. CMU had, UCLA, Waterloo, Harvard. Last year, which teams were uh, in better ranking? Uh, huh? CMU. CMU is really weird this year. CMU, yeah, yeah, it's below us. I don't expect them to beat us. What, what, what was the other team? Waterloo. Waterloo is good. Waterloo is below us as well. There are yeah. six. We beat them in the region. Okay, so. Yeah. Just a minute. Um, I I need to check. Oh, the voice on this thing. I want to go see. Let's see. Nice. nice. Let, let me check it again. Okay. Do you need me to double check? So, one, two, two, three, three, four, three, five. Possible. Possible. Is it possible? Yes. This is correct. Eight, six. This is correct. Nine, seven. No. Oh. 
It is one of our imaginary edges, is there is. <laughs> there is a deep in the edge. Yeah. Are you submitting again? Yeah, I think I have. I think I have. Let us know. <laughs> let's see, let's see. Um, I did some overflow fixing and some like actual meaningful bug fixes. Um, let's see, come on. Okay. Only 219. Two five, five, six, eight, seven, seven, eight. Okay. So what's on the bigger seven four? Yeah, that's fun. Okay. Um, the FSR W and Yeah. Okay. I mean, okay. Okay. So two submissions at once. Okay. Let's see. Ready? Alright, um, <laughs> wait, why is this so long? Uh, I didn't double it. Okay, alright, ready? Three, two, one, go. We're gonna both wrong answer. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, we got two X. Nice. One wrong. Oh, pass the test. Okay. Awesome. Let's go. Alright, alright, alright. Alright, you figure all right. out. Alright. We're in fifth again. We've never been better than fifth. Yep. We've always been exactly fifth. <laughs> yes. Alright, um...
Okay. Uh, Since I got him. H. He has a lot of stuff. Yes. Is there anyone that beats more than two accepts? Mm -hmm. Is there any problem with more than two accepts? Mm -hmm. You're sixth. Um, B, H, and M all have three. Oh, they now have three? Yeah. B, H. Let me think about these. I'm thinking on H. Uh -huh. Yeah. I'll do it. Uh, uh, yeah. Oh. <laughs> Why that happens? I, I probably know. I wouldn't know now. So, I was in here. I also need to disconnect. Okay. I was like that. I feel like. Wait, what is Both of the edges are imaginary, both between... Oh, both of the edges are... But that's not possible, because yeah. 2 and 9 have any... Let me, let me check. Uh, yeah, that should not four. be possible. Like, consecutive imaginary? Yes, yes, that, yes. Should not that, happen. Is, that is not possible. Nine. If I see eight of the previous one, this thing is a yeah. thing, then I remove it and then push press it. Okay, so yes, two pass. What, what does that pass mean? No, oh, it's like I have a new pass, so one, and then right. and then I push it into the passes, and it has two nine, and then eight, oh, okay. nine, six, two. Oh, so okay. it's probably not here. It's probably not yeah. because my pass is wrong, but like the casing right. is wrong. Yeah, it's yeah. in silver. Yeah, you. Sp that is in your splitting, yeah. right? Yeah, in my splitting. The K is greater than the number of paths. Now what is K? I mean, you can't both add no and subtract K. I didn't add. Oh wait, now it's like the index. <laughs> it's oh. Like I yeah. see. Um, oh. Should be really um, zero, one, two, zero, three, minus two. Three minus one is two. Yeah, this is crazy. Yeah. Now I can cut it. But what in the world? Why does the answer change so drastically? That doesn't make any sense. Why do you subtract? Okay, two, two nine, one. nine. Okay, that's fine. That's fine? Yeah. Do you think you can submit it again? I think I also need to detect another impossible case. Oh. I'm, I'm able to submit this, I think. You're submitting? Yeah. Awesome. You want to see? Yes. Uh, it might be wrong answer, I'm not sure. 
I don't think it's your TL. I think it might wrong answer. I'm not sure. Let me let me check my code up here. Okay. How fast is this? This is N login, so it shouldn't be that. So much. again, we have two problems in queue. What the fuck? Wait. Wait, why is that? It's not N square. Wait, what? Wait, that should not be a factor of six. Multiplying by two for subquadratic should not be a factor of six. Sorry. Oh, I know why. It's because the end of T is bigger. Two to the seventeenth. So we do one hundred forty. Okay. Is that many? Nice. Go for it. I hope so, because it works on all. Oh, that's the same thing. You're eight right now. Oh. <laughs> what? What? Yeah. Okay. What's wrong? <laughs> What's wrong? What's wrong? Okay guys, everything we do is it for this one. I don't know, I haven't seen this so much. <laughs> You're so many things? Pretty much, yeah. Oh, perfect. Okay. Um, Alright, ready? Do you want to get the phone? I <laughs> think it's... Yeah. But they can also see our reaction.
this works. the reason why I why you want it. So the thing is that I will push a single vertex to be attacked. Mm -hmm. So what is the point for? Oh that's the size. Oh I understand. Okay. Um so alright so D is in the works, oh. right? You guys have that? So that oh. leaves F, H and M. Um do you have anything on H? On H I was thinking about I was thinking about BP. Let me read it first, please. Yeah. Mm -hmm. We might as well read all the problems. So I think I have a solution to F, but it's kind of iffy, and I want to go through. Wait, this feels familiar. This feels very Oh 
two problems in there. Okay. Come on, we can do this. We can do this. Um, oh. We can do this. I feel much better. So we have three problems left. Two problems. Colin is on M, so I go back to H. Yeah. H, oh, yeah. U, the other one. Look at yeah. F. Yeah. So, <laughs> think about it again. I'll, I'll tell you my solution after a bit. Okay. I'm just going to do myself. Um, so what do you think this is? That begins with H. Oh, the input is random. Okay, I see. Oh, this is interesting. Okay, I, I kind of like this. I, I love random problems, actually. Um, So my, my guess is we fix some parameter and then say, if L is too big, then fuck everything. Um, that's our plan. Let's see. So what? Uh, I, I said you, you're talking about I'm thinking about M. I'm thinking about M. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> um, we have two problems left. And if we solve one first now, we, we get to the third problem. Yeah. OK, so 15, um, the, pr the probability is 10 to the negative 7. So we essentially have fewer than um, n m mod independent rules. Let's say 20. Let me, let me explain a little bit. 
So, um, for this problem, right, we say that this, so we're, we're building a sequence. Um, we're sort of. We're, we're building a sequence such that this is the biggest element so far, and that everything else in the sequence, nothing can go between here, nothing can go between here, nothing can go between here, nothing can go between here. So the only thing that can be added is over here. You agree that building the sequence that way is valid? Yeah. Okay. So then, to figure out what to do with this, what we need to do then is we can extend this sequence from points that are not dominated. So for example, this point is dominated, um, which means that we cannot extend this because then we get at something in the middle, right? So all we need to do is like get the set of points that are not dominated. Yeah, right. that's what I'm thinking. So what this is going to do is going to form sort of a, a diagonal like, path where we can have equality, but like it's going to look like this, right? And then when we add some new point in, it's going to obsolete some of these points. And then eventually like what we're doing is a range for right? Mm -hmm. You see what I mean? Yeah, like we're we're doing a range, we're doing an R and Q on some slice of these values. Sorted by this tag, like this tag, right? So we can build a second tree so, so the points are ordered by this tag, and then we can sweep in one direction. And as long as we maintain a set that has no dominated elements, which shouldn't be that hard, um, it shouldn't be that hard, right? So, yeah. Um, actually, how exactly do So we're assuming we're going to um, let's say we're going to insert from the top. So let's say we're going to insert we're going to insert points in this order, like in the order that I'm drawing. Um, and when we get this point, we can possibly obsolete anything. In It's going to be some suffix, right? It's going to be some suffix of our path. Mm -hmm. Does that fit then? Does that just work? Do you think that works, Sam? Do you believe in that? Do you understand what I'm saying? Hmm? What about here? Like the same as? Oh, like, if, we, if we go top down, then like. What? Oh. Then like, this is the only point that can ever obsolete any. Top down? Yeah. Top, like left to right and then top down. Then the first point in any column is going to be the only point that can ever obsolete anything else. Which means that even though we add this, even though we have this in our path blocking the suffix, like we've already removed everything that this could possibly remove. So yeah, so we keep a second tree sorted by diagonal. You have to like get the slice that it covers, right? And then which is like um it's also going to be a suffix, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Yeah. This should actually be like not that bad, right? Like, yeah. Actually, actually that might be easy. Wait, 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 wait. Sorry. Um. One sec. Um, obsolution is maybe a problem. Actually, we might want to go this way. No. Um, yeah, wait, what am I saying? I can't just like. Does it matter? It does. Why? Why? Because this. Does it? It might. Yeah, it would, wouldn't it? Because like this might draw on this, and like this doesn't stop. Actually, the, 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 the thing is we can take exactly one thing from each column, which means this, this column should actually be independent choices. Like, nothing from the rest of this column should affect it, right? It shouldn't affect the, the set of oxidative points. It's like strictly, so... Hmm? Strictly, so we just cannot affect any... We just cannot affect two. Yeah. Okay, so, 
So what that means is it's a bit more nuanced. We have to process everything in this column simultaneously, look at what this does to this suffix, and then and only then remove the oscillated points. Do you agree? Yeah, nice. Yeah, we just got H. Uh, this is good. This is alright. <laughs> I don't know. So. Actually, my my phone ran out of charge. I'm using Collins. Why is the time limit one second? Why is it one second? <laughs> on, yeah, I saw the H. There are two problems left. One second. M and F. Sam is doing F. Yeah, call it. So I'm kind of done with the contest. <laughs> it would be great if we can solve all the problems. Yeah, like we might be able to, but we probably need. Yeah, Sam told me that it's hard to say yes. Do you need I me? I don't think it's that hard, it's just, I don't know what's happening. I don't know. Do you want to explain, Sam? I'm yellow. What? <laughs> <laughs> I'm yellow. You are out here. Um, do, do you want to explain? Or I don't know, I can help any of you if you want. Oh, I'm thinking about it.
every try edge has weight zero or one, depending on if you have to take the, a different character. Um, and the number of paths to leaves at distance zero from the root, or at, at distance at most two from the root, is very low. This is a what is a stock sequence or stock sequence? Subject. Okay. Your general idea is to build a tri of all the substring of length L and then sort of walk on it. Um, I see. And if that should be fast, and it is fast, but the constant is not good enough. The current one. Which is set. Decide that the, the characters can only differ on the second half, then you basically do no work. Conversely, if you reverse every substring and decide it can only happen on the second half of that, which is the first half of the original substring, you also do. Um, because of like the randomness. So then we can have the points where we have one in the first half and one in the second. does not that much work. So that those that makes it about two seconds with one, which is sad. Um, but it's like not bad with one. I just have one that makes it better. The split in the second half thing is pretty smart, but it's not ideal. I think. Um, is it going? Pretty much assume that every node is a, a link plus. We we'll pretty much work with the notion that every substring is independent. So you're substring the original string. But yeah, let me make sure now is better to assume they're not independent, which is fine. I'm not so confident in the try thing pending it, but
Build a tri for all frequencies and all sequences. And we say, we find out how far we can get in that tri with at most one variation on the frequency. Oh, yeah. We do the same for the suffix. And we fix the, we fix the second character that we vary. And we check if any frequency or suffix like, lines up. Um, that should make the tri thing a lot less expensive. I can see. Um, we, I don't actually use like four. from two variations to one with no added cost. Like there's no extra work that we do in this transformation. What is exactly what we do? So we build a tri of all frequencies, like the new thing? Or the yes, the new thing. Um, so we build a tri of all frequencies and suffixes. And we ask the frequencies, how far can we get in the string with zero changes? And how far can we get with one change? And then we do the same for the suffix. And then all we need to do is fix the, the second character we change and then check it. Oh. Like we can do the rest with that most one change. Oh, yeah. Um, try a previous and suffix fits in there barely, but it does. Building the try for the prefix and suffix is actually like too much time. Um,
just sweep and do it.
shouldn't be wrong. There's a bug in here. Sort of like online ceremony? Yeah, there is. It's in the email. It's, not, it's like basically what you We don't know what we're Okay. So, guys, we are sick now. We have one skull to grow, which is Greece. And so maybe we will come back to talk about it. But it was fun. Yeah, we have great support in the Where can we have the challenge? <laughs> the challenge? Do it.
Meet in the university is your first. Meet in the university. You better not see if you and you better not hustle. Yeah. And in every other university. We have CMU, we have UCLA, we have Harvard, what they do, Princeton, Columbia, they go to us. California, very good. Hear what we're talking about, what we're saying about this.